good morning children welcome to a new class so now you are in class 4 and today you are going to learn the very first lesson of your maths that is numbers and numerals but one thing you should remember only learning will not do you have to solve the exercise also so in the following classes when we will give you the exercises solve the sums in your old copy later on you can do it in your new copy now let's comes to the point that is numbers you know what numbers are the numbers are which we count like 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 etc it goes on it continues and these numbers i am going to teach you today only the two kinds the two kinds of numbers are natural numbers and whole numbers what are natural numbers the numbers which we are counting that means the numbers which we start counting from 1 like 1 2 3 4 etc it goes on these are called as natural numbers but whole numbers whole numbers are also all the natural numbers including 0 so these numbers we start counting from 0 like 0 1 2 3 4 5 etc it goes on and the smallest natural number is 1 whereas the smallest whole number is 0 so you have learned about the two kinds of numbers now we are going to learn about the system of numbers means how to read or how to write the numbers so in this class we are going to learn about the two system of numbers that is indian system and another one is international system indian system is the system which we follow in our country to write the number names indian system of numbers this indian system of numbers you see there are seven places ones tens hundred thousand ten thousand lakhs ten lakhs and these seven places have been grouped into three periods ones period thousands period lakhs period ones period is having three places that is ones tens hundreds thousands period is having two places that is thousands and ten thousands and lakhs period is having two places lakhs and ten lakhs and we put the commas just before the periods like ones period count from right three boxes or three numbers place the comma then again you count two boxes place the comma that is thousands period over see like example 8 5 2 3 4 3 7 from the right side you count three digits 7 3 4 3 place the comma then two digits 3 2 place the comma then 5 8 before 5 8 we should not put the comma because there is no more number now you see over here the 4 3 7 that those three numbers belongs to ones period then 2 3 this belongs to thousands period 8 5 this belongs to lakhs period now when we read out if i ask you to read out the numbers how will you read out 4 3 7 we will read out as 437 2 3 how we will say 23 and this 23 is in which period thousands period 8 5 it is 85 it is in what period lakhs period so here while saying we will say as 85 lakhs 23000 Four hundred thirty-seven. So while writing in words, see it is written eighty-five lakh twenty-three thousand four hundred thirty-seven. As you are growing, your class also has been increased, so you have to learn more. Now we are going to learn about the large numbers of Indian system. What you have learned just now, the same thing. Only two more periods will increase. that is one period thousands period lakhs period already you have learned now two more periods is crores period and arabs period crores period will also have two places crores and 10 crores arabs period will also have two places arabs and 10 arabs now see here also the rule is same first from the right side you count three digits put the comma then again two digits place the comma again two digits place the comma again two digits place the comma see for example the number 2674356520 how to place the commas count from right side the last three digits 602 place the comma 
five six place the comma that is two digits over again two digits five three place the comma again two digits four seven place the comma then six two now see two zero six this comes under the ones period six five sixty five comes in thousands period three five thirty five comes in lakhs period seven four seventy four comes in crores period two six twenty six comes in arabs period so we say twenty six arab seventy four crore thirty five lakh sixty five thousand two hundred six so what you are going to learn now is totally new it is the international system of numbers this international system of numbers are see over here it has nine places and these nine places have been grouped into three periods ones period thousands period millions period so ones period has three places that is one stands hundred which is same as indian system thousands period is having three periods one thousand ten thousand and hundred thousand and millions period is having three places millions 10 millions 100 millions so here we will put the commas just before the periods that is from right side count three digits place the comma again count three digits place the comma see for example over here 9456205789 from the right side count three digits 875 place the comma 026 place the comma 549 578 this comes in ones period 620 this comes in thousand period 945 comes in million period so 578 we say as 578 Six two zero means six hundred twenty. When we read out, we read out three these three numbers together. We say six hundred twenty, and this belongs to thousand period. So how we will say six hundred twenty thousand and nine four five? If I ask you to read out, we will say nine hundred forty five, and this belongs to million period. So we say nine hundred forty five million. See when we will read out or when you will write, we say like this nine hundred forty five million. Six hundred twenty thousand five hundred seventy-eight. So, children, as you have learned about the large numbers of Indian system, we are going to learn about the large numbers of international system too. So, what you have learned just now, up to ones, thousands, and millions period. Here also, two more periods will increase: billions and trillions. And billions also is divided into three places. trillions also is divided into three places so it comes like this one period three places one stands 100 thousand place period also three places thousand ten thousand hundred thousand millions period also has three places millions ten millions hundred millions billions also has three places billions ten billions hundred billions whereas trillions also has three places trillions 10 trillions 100 trillions so the same rule we will apply here we will put the comma by counting three digits from the right side start counting three digits place the comma again count three digits place the comma again count three digits place the comma see the example the number given here is 6263364272 8176 so count from right side 671 place the comma 802 place the comma 724 place the comma 633 place the comma so 176 that is 176 comes in ones period 208208 comes in thousands period 427427 comes in millions period 336 336 comes in billions period 626 626 comes in trillions period so when we say or we write we say like this 626 trillion 336 billion 427 million 208176 
so children in your next class i will give you the exercises be ready with your old copy to solve the exercises thank you